Hello, David Snowpack here from Snowpack Games with another progress report on adding WebXR support to the Godot game engine. So last time uh, I had WebXR working in a Firefox browser on the desktop using the WebXR emulator extension. So you could go click enter VR, then you'd see the video from both eyes, be able to manipulate our little virtual headset guy here and see that reflected in the view there. And that still works. But now, uh, rather than just working in the emulator, it also works in a real Oculus Quest headset. So let me show you that. So here you can see that same page opened up in the Oculus browser on my Oculus Quest. Uh, you can see that the animation is a little bit choppy. It looks that way to me too on the headset until I switch to immersive VR here. And now the animation looks perfectly smooth. And I can look all around. Uh, the head tracking is working fine. I can look at our enormous sun over here, fog in the distance. Uh, below me, there is this white cube, actually two white cubes that are on top of each other. Those are supposed to be following the controllers uh, to represent hands, but there isn't controller support yet. That's one of the things I'm going to be working on over the next uh, week or so. And then I can bring up the menu here and actually exit this immersive web experience. And it brings me back to the browser where the cube continues animating, although the view is a little bit distorted. You can see it's kind of stretched. Um, if I resize the browser window, it goes back to normal. So that's a bug I still need to figure out. Uh, but then you can jump back into VR if you want and uh, you know get the smooth cube and the, the full experience here. I'm super happy with the progress that I've made this week. Uh, next up, I've got uh, controller support, which I've already mentioned. Uh, improving the API. There's a whole bunch of things that are currently hard-coded that really the developer should be providing as parameters to WebXR. Cleanup and bug fixes. So, so far so good. Uh, stay tuned for my next update. Thanks. Talk to you later.